are people with a particular blood type more susceptible to COVID-19? That's a question that many have asked. Researchers in China believe so, but they haven't managed to convince the global medical fraternity yet. Experts say that China's research findings are, mat are a matter of pure coincidence. If found to be true, it can be of great help in identifying people who are most at risk. This report has all the details. Even as most of the world is locked down and governments are scrambling to keep people at home and isolated, an important breakthrough could help in tracking and isolating COVID-19. A preliminary study has found correlations between blood type and the likelihood of being hospitalized. Chinese researchers studied blood group patterns of those admitted to hospitals with COVID-19. Scientists and doctors in Beijing, Wuhan, Shanghai and Shenzhen were involved. Samples were taken from where the first ever case was reported, Wuhan city and Shenzhen city as well. Those blood type patterns were then compared to the local healthy populations. The study concluded that patients with a certain blood group had a higher rate of infection. They also tended to get more severe symptoms, while those of another blood type were less likely to get infected. Those with blood type A may be more vulnerable to the novel coronavirus, while those with type O have seemed more resistant. Of 206 patients who died in Wuhan, 85 had type A blood, which was 63 percentage more than those with type O. The pattern existed across different age and gender groups. Blood type difference has been observed in other major infectious diseases, including the Norwalk virus, hepatitis B and SARS. But this latest study on COVID-19 has not been peer-reviewed and the authors have cautioned that there are risks to using the study to guide current clinical practice. Critics say that this study is flawed. The biggest problem being its sample size which is a little over 2,000. Though not small, it is way too less than the 180,000 plus total cases globally. Experts say that there is nothing more than a coincidental correlation. The study, if at all helpful, will be only to medical professionals. And the general public must not take these statistics too seriously and worry. Pure Report, we on World is One.